solve this equation, we note that it can be written in, as a quadratic form. If I let r to the one-third be the item that I place inside the parentheses, which indeed is what would go here, I know that r to the one-third squared is r to the two-thirds. I can do a substitution at this point. I'll let u equal r to the one-third, so then I can write 3u squared plus 11u minus 42 equals 0. Uh, this is a quadratic equation now. I'll use the quadratic formula to solve for u. So we have u equal to minus b plus or minus b squared minus 4ac, all multiplied, and we'll put that over 2 times a. Simplifying this, if you evaluate what's underneath the radical, you will get 625. That's all over 6. Now that simplifies to negative 11 plus or minus 25 over 6. At this point, I can write this as u equal to negative 11 plus 25 over 6, or u equal to negative 11 minus 25 over 6. Evaluating this, we'll have 14 6, which is 7 thirds, or negative 36 over 6, which is negative 6. Now we're not solving for u, we're solving for r. So r, u is equal to r to the one-third. So I'll write r to the one-third equals seven-thirds or r to the one-third equals negative six. We solve each of these equations by raising both sides to the third power. One-third times three is one. So we get r is equal to, now when you cube this, you cube the top and the bottom. 7 cubed is 343, 3 cubed is 27. We'll cube both sides of this equation as well. So we'll get r is equal to negative 216.